In the gospel today, we experience Jesus as one who is full of anticipation, anxiousness, and avid desire for the fire of God's justice, mercy, and love to take hold of the earth. He is passionate to fulfill the mission given to him by his Father. Fire is the symbol in which God was manifested to Moses in the burning bush. The Israelites were led by fire in the night through the desert. John the Baptist said, I baptize you with water, but one will come after me that will baptize with the Holy Spirit and with fire. And of course, the tongues of fire descended on Mary and the apostles at Pentecost. Our God is a consuming fire, not lukewarm, cold, tepid, or without conviction. Today, let us follow Jesus by opening our hearts and minds to the fire of God's love that we may live and work for the fullness of God's reign to come upon the earth. I close with a poem by William Blake. Unless the eye catch fire, the God will not be seen. Unless the ear catch fire, the God will not be heard. Unless the tongue catch fire, the God will not be named. Unless the heart catch fire, the God will not be loved. Unless the mind catch fire, the God will not be known. <laughs>